Kentucky lawmakers are rejecting an attempt to rewrite the state's public funding for schools. The state Senate killed a bill with a 27 to 21 vote. A number of Republicans broke ranks and voted with Democrats. The bill would have replaced the state's 21-year-old Mississippi Adequate Education Program with a new formula. Senator Hoff Bryan, who made the motion to kill the bill, argues that the new proposals are based on faulty data and has not thoroughly been considered. The decision visibly upset Lieutenant Governor Tate Reeves. The fact is, uh, there were 27 senators, all of the Democrats, who voted to say they didn't want to spend $108 million more on K-12 funding. Senate Education Chair Greg Tolleson says that senators should have moved forward with the bill because the current formula does not fairly distribute money. Speaker of the House Philip Gunn also weighed in saying, quote, I commend the House members who voted in favor of this solid legislation. At the beginning of the session, they recognized that our children are a priority. I'm very disappointed that the Senate missed the opportunity to provide our school children with a better funding mechanism.